man of the moment. Four goals in three games, you can't argue with that. Hello, a warm welcome, and this is the scene here in North London. I'm Derek Ray, and sitting next to me with his tactics charts at the ready is Stuart Robson. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It is Tottenham Hotspur versus Manchester United. Well, that was a good result on match day one for United. Yes, there were a few tired legs towards the end of the game, but in the main, they looked a well-drilled outfit. More of the same today, I expect. And here's the lineup for Manchester United. Tom Heaton is the goalkeeper. Rafael Varane plays with Victor Lindelof in central defence. Bruno Fernandes plays with Casemiro in the centre of the pitch. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. Well, the last match for Manchester United was a success story as they won against Wolverhampton Wanderers. How do you anticipate it going this time, Stuart? Well, the fans certainly enjoyed the 3-1 victory, didn't they? It was a really good display. Today, however, they may not enjoy quite as much of the ball and therefore a draw looks the most likely outcome. Well, Gabby is one of those non-stop, relentless performers and he's making his debut for his new club today. What might he produce out there on the pitch? Well, he's a good player, no doubt about that. And he will certainly improve their midfield. Oh, Stewart, an opportunity! Well, the pass got in the way. Kane? Well, not a cross that will live long in the memory. Goal kick. Well, we wondered if this deal was going to be done. In fact, it has now been done, Stuart. Well, he's certainly got ability. A lot of clubs have been in for him. But now he needs to fulfil that potential. He might just have to be patient, though. Dallo. Crossing opportunity. Needs to clear it away. And he has options available. Must take the lead here. Return to Bentancourt. And it's come off the keeper. Well, just to point you in the right direction, we have more live action from the Premier League coming up here on EA TV. It's Tottenham Hotspur facing Bournemouth. Well, the fixtures are coming thick and fast. It should be a good game, that. Hopefully, I've not just given it the commentator's curse. Fernandes. He cuts it back. And the keeper there to deal with it. There will be one minute added on at the end. Half time then here in the English capital. Well, they've got things going again here, and I wonder what kind of second half we have in store for us. Options in the middle. Well, nothing he could really do based on the cross. Just a quick reminder, we have more action from the Premier League coming your way. It's Manchester United facing Nottingham Forest. Cutting the ball back. Brilliantly blocked. Well, possibilities inside the box. I think most defenders would expect to be booked halting an attack in that fashion. And a yellow card, it's going to be Stewart. Yeah, the ref's got that right. It's a yellow card all day long. And he whips it in. Was it a great clearance? Well, there's an example of how to press high up. A smart stop here. So a personnel change then. Well, they haven't created too much lately, but the fans know this is a chance to take the lead. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Well, capable of a better clearance than that. Well, maybe a good position from which to counter. Well, it was a brilliant break, but no goal as a result. Well, forget the finish and just admire the way they counter-attack there. They did it with such pace and quality. Fernandes. Well, the flag has gone up here. Offside it is. Oh. 
Now they have possession in a good area of the pitch. And the challenge, crisp and clean. Well, maybe room here for the counter-attack. Well, as you can hear, the fans think that should have been a penalty, but I'm not convinced. Had a chance to whip it in here. Ericsson. And he takes it on. Oh, they've done it! They forged ahead, and it might be the goal that gives them victory. Well, I think that shows what a good rapport he has with the players. Well, as you can see, that's a great half volley. He controls it so well, that could have gone anywhere. United have been getting two substitutes ready, and both will come on. Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. And just five minutes remaining. Feeding it through. Rashford. And there it is! Two goals in a matter of minutes. Incredible stuff. Well, here it is again, and it's a superbly weighted through ball to break that defensive line. And the finish is brilliant from Rashford. He hits it so sweetly. That's a top-class goal. And the ball is moving again. 2-0 is how it stands. Well, as we approach full-time in this one, Stuart, no escaping the conclusion that United are bossing this. Well, they've been much the better side up to now. Some of their approach play has been excellent. They just need to control possession for these final few minutes to cap off a really good display. Christian Eriksen now. Shaw. Bruno Fernandes. In it goes to rubber stamp it once and for all. Well, they love him and he loves them. It's great scenes here. Well, he wasn't going to waste this chance. 1v1 against the keeper, and he slots it away with great confidence. That's a good finish. Is this going to be a thrashing? 3-0 now. Kane. Happy to shoot. Great defending. And that is the end of the game. It goes down as a United triumph. The fans are going to be happy with this. Well, I've been really impressed with them, Derek. They've shown a lot of good qualities in their first couple of games. I think they're going to have an excellent season. I really do.